Hey everyone, welcome to the 13th episode of Investing Kev. We are two months in this channel kicking off, and I am very thankful for all of you for tuning in and showing support. In today's episode, we're going to continue my fascination with the electric vehicle industry by taking a look at Lucid Motors, ticker LCID. Lucid recently merged with Churchill Capital and debuted on the NASDAQ on July 26th, so it went from its previous ticker of CCIV to now LCID. We'll take a look at Lucid's company overview, its vehicle lineup, its financials, outlook, risks, and price target. Feel free to check out my most recent video. I chose 10 long-term growth stocks I would invest in if I had $1,000 to start off. And I also have quite a bit of electric vehicle industry stock breakdowns, so check out my NEO, Xpeng, Li Auto, and ChargePoint videos after this video. If you like this content, please like this video and consider subscribing. I also have a link in the description below to my investing spreadsheet. You can follow me as I dollar cost average into four different investing strategies and see how each strategy performs after a year. With all that being said, let's get started and let's learn about Lucid Motors. Taking a look at Lucid's company overview, this is what they have to say. The spirit of California moves us to think beyond mobility and design for a world where life is the most important journey we'll ever take. To look beyond tomorrow and shape a future where we no longer have to choose between doing great things and doing the right thing. And to explore beyond ourselves and create experiences that remind us what it's like to feel truly alive. One of the key pillars of Lucid is sustainability. They aim to create sustainable mobility without compromising cars that are intuitive, liberating, and designed for all the ways people get around. At Lucid, they place an exceptionally high priority on efficiency. Their cars must make the best possible use of the world's resources. So every Lucid delivers exceptional range without sacrificing high performance or sublime comfort. Lucid believes that leadership makes them stand out. Lucid's leadership team brings to our Silicon Valley headquarters an extraordinary depth of knowledge and experience from the automotive and technology industries. They're leading us forward to a more sustainable future as we use proprietary electric vehicle technology to reinvent the category for each type of car we build. And recently, Lucid opened up their massive facility in Casa Grande, Arizona. This facility is the first greenfield or purpose-built EV factory in North America. The facility is designed to their exact specifications and it is being built with such efficiency and speed that they will complete construction of its first phase a mere 12 months after breaking ground. It is outfitted with the world's most advanced production line equipment, and the factory will have the initial capacity to produce 10,000 cars a year and over 300,000 annually with planned expansion. Lucid is focusing on changing luxury market values. They're focusing on the post-luxury space, in which post-luxury consumers increasingly seek brands that align with their values. Brands that are more enlightened, informed, and inspired. As a leading EV brand that offers sustainable luxury, performance, and advanced connectivity, Lucid is ideally positioned to address the wants and needs of a new generation of post-luxury consumers. On the left-hand side, you can see traditional luxury consists of status, opulence, materialism, indulgence, and physical engagement. Whereas on the right-hand side, post-luxury consists of well-being, refinement, experience, sustainability, physical, and emotional engagement. And with post-luxury, you have increased expectations. They look past traditional definitions of luxury in order to appeal to customers who expect more, including brand values, experiences, and designs with constraints. Lucid appeals to people who value purpose and meaning and who realize that the decisions they make have an impact. Lucid appeals to people who are no longer willing to compromise for luxury since they can have performance, technology, and sustainability. As you can see, the Tesla logo, they are innovative, but they're not luxury. You have BMW, which is sport luxury, Mercedes, which is classic luxury, and Audi, which is tech luxury. Lucid combines all of them to be post-luxury, where they're sport, classic, and tech, and they're innovative at the same time. Currently, Lucid has no vehicles delivered, but that's changing in the second half to 2021. Lucid's first product, the Lucid Air, fuses art and science to capture the full potential of electrification. As Lucid's flagship product, the Air establishes the bar for excellence across all Lucid products and experiences. The Lucid Air will be starting from $77,000, they have a max projected range greater than 500 miles, and they have a max horsepower of 1,080 HP. And with the Lucid Air, they're introducing the space concept, where it's spacious, luxurious interior with a compact and efficient exterior. Lucid space concept represents a technical breakthrough, achieved through a ground-up rethink in a way an automobile is designed. Lucid's reimagining of the car has resulted in more interior space for the driver, passengers, and storage within a more compact, sporty, and efficient exterior. And with a drag coefficient of only 0.21, Lucid Air offers outstanding aerodynamics that enable greater range and performance. And Lucid states that efficiency is the ultimate measure of EV technology, and Lucid is a clear winner. High efficiency is crucial in that it provides key benefits such as longer range in its own right, faster miles per minute charging for equivalent power charger, 
an equivalent range with a smaller and therefore lower cost battery pack. As you can see, the Lucid Air gets greater than 4.5 miles per kilowatt hour with a vehicle range of 517 plus miles. That beats out its competitors such as Tesla Model S, which gets greater than 4 miles per kilowatt hour and gets a range of 412 miles. And as you go down the list, you can see that Jaguar, Porsche, and Audi, they get a vehicle range of around 220 miles. And Lucid's advanced technology has enabled long range and high performance to coexist. Other EVs have either range or performance, but not both. On the left hand side, you have the Lucid Air Dream Edition and the Lucid Air Grand Touring. When looking at the top chart, you can see that both of them have a mile range of greater than 500 miles, which is something their competitors do not meet. They both have a top speed of 168 miles per hour, which beats out most of its competitors except for the Tesla Model S Plaid. And taking a look at the 0 to 60 times, the Lucid Air Dream Edition can go to 0 to 60 in less than 2.5 seconds, the Grand Touring at less than 3 seconds, which is on par or better than most of its competitors. And the Lucid Air is expected to be offered at various price points with different specifications. You can see on the far right you have the Lucid Air Pure, which is starting off at $77,400, all the way up to the Dream Edition, which is a $169,000 inclusive cost. Each Lucid Air Edition will have different horsepower, different range, different costs, and different reservation payments. And one cool thing I really like about Lucid is that the Lucid Air is underpinned by the Lucid Electric Advanced Platform, also known as LEAP which is designed to support other vehicle variants, enabling greater capital deployment efficiency and speed to market. The LEAP platform incorporates Lucid's six key powertrain elements designed and developed fully in-house. They have the battery pack and battery management software. They have their electric motors, power electronics, transmission, control software, and two-way onboard boost charger. You can see that the 2021 Lucid Air, the projected 2023 Project Gravity, and potentially other future vehicles will all be using the LEAP platform. When taking a look at the finances of Lucid, one has to look at the luxury vehicle market opportunity. The global luxury car market was estimated to be $495.7 billion in 2018 and is projected to reach $733.2 billion by 2026, registering a compound annual growth rate of 5% from 2018 to 2026. This presents an opportunity for a true luxury EV company to address unmet needs and revolutionize this market. With increased government mandates for electrification, combined with consumers' growing desire for clean energy vehicles, electrification of the automotive industry is taking place globally at a rapid pace, representing 5% of all new car sales in 2020. And by 2030, Lucid anticipates a run rate production of greater than 500,000 units, representing a 4% market share of an anticipated 2030 total addressable market of 15 million units. And looking at total revenues, they're projected to have a $2.2 billion in revenue. And by 2026, they will have $22.7 billion in total revenues. This jump in revenues coincides with their future car releases. In 2022, they're predicted to have a 20,000 annual total delivery. And by 2026, they will have 251 annual total deliveries. With 42,000 made up of luxury sedans, 134,000 of SUVs, and 75,000 of other future models. And as a growing company, you need to market your product. Lucid is building out showrooms and service centers which offer customers immersive and engaging brand and product experience. This is a direct sales strategy that enables full control over the customer experience to ensure that the interactions are on brand and pressure free. You can see that there are multiple Lucid studios that are currently open and many more that are under construction and in development. When I take a look at the outlook of Lucid, I had to look at their management team. Companies need the right leadership to guide them, especially when they're brand new and entering an unsaturated market. There are lofty expectations, and I believe Lucid has a great cast. As you can see, their management consists of a lot of ex-Tesla members. You have people who've worked for Ford, Volkswagen, Honda, Mazda, Apple, Cisco, and many more companies. These are legacy car brands mixed in with tech giants combining to create a luxury vehicle lineup. I think Lucid has a great mix of experience on their side with different people with different viewpoints working from different companies in the past. That past experience and exchange of information is really crucial in my opinion for these companies to realize their potential and to execute their vision. And taking a look at Lucid at a glance, they have proven tech breakthroughs, which are setting new standards. They have over 20 million real world vehicle miles driven. They have 407 patent applications filed, which 80% have been issued. They have 10 plus years of design, engineering, manufacturing track record. They have the first purpose built EV facility in North America with 34,000 units of annual production capacity and a planned annual capacity of 365,000 units. Taking a look at their revolutionary battery system and range, it takes about 20 minutes to charge up to 300 miles with a 900 volt architecture. 
In taking a look at their growing loyal customers, they received greater than 9,000 reservations as of May 2021, which is greater than $800 million in potential sales represented by reservations. And in 2023, Lucid is going to release a Project Gravity, which redefines sport and utility for luxury SUVs. They are reimagining the SUV. Project Gravity elevates the SUV to a new level with extraordinary performance as well as category redefining interior space. And taking a look at Lucid Air's vehicle pipeline, in 2021, they'll release the Lucid Air. In 2023, they'll release the Project Gravity, and by 2030, they will have planned sedans, planned SUVs, and other planned vehicles. Another thing I like about Lucid is that they see future growth opportunities that extend beyond Lucid vehicles. They have their energy storage systems, also known as ESS, which are positioned to address the home, commercial, and utility-scale energy storage markets. And they also focus on being a technology supplier. Currently, all OEM racing teams in the world's premier EV racing series are powered by Lucid battery packs and software. Their in-house technology is designed for mass production at Lucid's purpose-built manufacturing facility, which positions Lucid well for large-scale supply to other OEMs. And they also have a huge potential for a wide range of applications, including aircraft, EVTOL, military, heavy machinery, agriculture, and marine. In all my electric vehicle videos, the same number one risk factor is the government. Lucid can have all these plans to expand globally, but if the governments in these respective countries don't have the laws, don't have the push for renewable energy for their future, it's very hard to expand. You need to have the laws in place so charging ports can be built, so EV vehicles can start rolling out and creating that culture where people want to choose electric vehicles over internal combustion engines. The government sets the standards and you can see that in many countries in the European Union, in China, and in the US for that push for a greener future. The second risk factor is competition. Lucid is going against Tesla here in America, but not just Tesla. You have Mercedes, BMW, Audi, and many more car brands that are going to be rolling out their electric vehicle lineups. Lucid currently has a technological edge compared to these legacy car brand companies. But we'll see if that translates to people moving away from brands they know and love to taking on a new brand that doesn't even have a car on the road yet. Overseas, Lucid has plans to expand in China in 2023. China is a massive EV market, and I believe you cannot be successful without trying to enter the largest EV market in the world. Lucid will be going against Chinese-backed NIO, Xpeng, Li Auto, and many more for the race to take as much market share around the world. Lucid needs to build a moat just like a lot of these other new companies, and will they be able to do that? Will their technology make them stand out, and will their leadership guide them well and position them well to thrive? When looking at 12-month price targets, I usually look to TipRanks or CNN, but they currently do not have a price target available for Lucid. I want to say this about Lucid or any stock in the future that might be of interest to you. When it comes to stocks with a lot of unknown, like Lucid, which has a lot of potential but no actual deliveries, I personally like to initiate a small position and slowly build over time. I dollar cost average over time, and once the company has an established brand being used by consumers and word of mouth, reviews, etc., I like to keep track of that timeline. If you believe in Lucid and believe in its future, then you likely believe that $23.72 is a really good price entry at this point in time. You can dollar cost average through the highs and lows and continue to accumulate to reach the percentage of your portfolio you want it to be. Overall, I believe Lucid has a bright future as they have a solid management team and their cars look great. For full disclosure, I'm not invested in Lucid at all. I personally want to see actual deliveries of their cars and how things are going with deliveries and reviews. Lucid is competing against car companies with an already strong brand name to them. Lucid is focusing on the marketing aspect by opening showrooms across the country and to catch people's eyes. I think their product looks great and they're offering a battery range that no other competitor in the US market can offer right now and they have a vision with a timeline of how to reach their goals. There's no doubt the EV industry is rising and I believe there will be multiple winners in the EV sector. This looks like a very strong technology and automotive company. At this point in time, Lucid has a great control of their vision, and I think they're going to execute things well. If you like this video, please give a thumbs up, let me know what you think in the comments below, and please subscribe. As always, stay safe, and I will see you all next time.